Hello guys, it is Duke, and welcome back to the episode of Afterlife SMP. Guys, there's a few things, alright? I'm just gonna start off really, really great with this episode, because there's a lot of things that we can be happy about right now. First of all, it's probably really obvious, our custom sky's back, yes! So, I realized, you know... Ever since 1.9, I have not been able to use the custom sky that I used to use, and I really, really loved it. It was, it's beautiful. I mean, everything about it was just wonderful, and it made videos look so much better. So I thought, yeah, you know, it's, it's, it's not really something that's really going to change anything about my videos. Uh, but I, I was looking at it today, and I'm just like, hey, you know, I really, really miss it. So... I went ahead, downloaded a new version, and just look how those towers look with the clouds behind it. Oh, it's beautiful. I really, really love this. Um, you know, it's just sort of one of those things um, that just makes me feel good. It really does. It puts a smile on my face when I see it because the default Minecraft sun and moon and clouds and skies are just super boring. And I really, really really don't like it because it's just so boring and ugly and ill so now that we have this everything's good uh, we can start to work on the house today that's what we're gonna be doing today uh, but before we really truly start let's just talk about something guys this is something we should be really really happy about because it shows everything we've sort of worked for is finally paying off uh, and I'm really happy to see this so as of last night, I don't remember what exactly time it was, we hit 200 subscribers on YouTube, and I am so happy, guys. That really puts a smile on my face. Uh, I don't plan on doing anything special for it, uh, just because I feel like 250 is sort of the more appropriate sort of goal to have. I mean, 200 is great, and that means, you know, it's, it's double the size of my channel that it was this time last year uh, but 250 I, I just really love that number a lot more than 200 so that's what we're gonna do uh, any sort of subscriber thing uh, but but I'm really pleased really really pleased with how things are going on the YouTube channel lately and uh, being able to have this YouTube sub purge as it's been titled happen and I was really worried how long it was gonna take for us to recover uh, we actually lost about 12 subscribers from it something like that and I was really bummed to see that because before we were at 197 and I was like okay you know we're we're getting some track we're, we're finally getting some sort of traction yes I'll say that word again um, that'll allow us to say hey you know we're finally we're finally gaining some sort of YouTube um, so you know so we're going somewhere which was cool because up until then we hadn't had that and uh, now that we we had I was I was really really pumped and I was noticing my commentary and everything were just spot on I mean I was doing really really well for myself and then all of a sudden at once the YouTube sub purge happened lost some subscribers and all that momentum we had just was gone. It was really quite disappointing because all that time that we worked for that didn't mean nothing. I won't say that because it, it did. Um, but all that feeling that we had that you know things were getting better, things were changing, the times were were going to be great, no longer were the case. So that was super super bummy, sort of a disappointing period of time. Um, but now that's changed, and I'm happy that can be the case because we've only got one way to go guys and that's up and it's a great thing that I can realize that because you know sometimes sometimes through YouTube at this age of the game and when I say the game I mean the YouTube game it's really easy to get unmotivated because you know Jay told me this once uh, the YouTube the, the 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 rank oh I can't put those together that's not gonna work um, but the search 
for YouTube Let's Plays has been on the decline since like 2011 or something, uh, which is a long time ago. And I forget how do you make a redstone, or how do you make a trap chest? I I have no clue. Do we need a redstone torch? Do we need a ooh? What are the tripwire hook? Um. Try a redstone torch. I don't know if that's it. I honestly don't know at all. I think it's over in the same chest again. Let's just grab some wood then. Uh, but yeah, seeing any growth now sort of really just makes me happy because I'm like, hey, there's a decent chance that I'll probably never get to where I'd like to and at some point, and I cannot figure this out. Um, so we'll just forget that for now. But it is a lot harder to grow now than it used to be uh, just because there's so many people trying to do this and there's a lot of people that I have to say are probably better than I am so when, when I put that in perspective that anything we're actually doing is kind of impressive seeing any sort of change I should honestly just thank um, you guys and my friends and myself for putting in the effort to get us there because it truly, truly is becoming more difficult. And do I like that? I don't know. Uh, but yeah, like I said, I plan on doing some sort of subscriber thing when I hit 250 subscribers. But for now, probably not. Uh, I, uh, right now, I'm just sort of working on getting the house laid out. And because I, I really feel like we could really make the interior of this really become something special. So, uh, back to the subscriber thing. I am really pleased with it, um, even though it's taken a long time, guys. I have been doing this YouTube thing for a very long time in relation to a lot of other people that are growing a lot quicker than I am. And that's one thing that sort of gets me down every once in a while. Sometimes I'm like, well, you know, I'm not growing as fast as this person. Uh, that, that must mean something. I must not be as good as they are. I must not have the sort of potential and skill that they do and I don't know why that is um, but I just really got down on myself sometimes because of that but I, I've realized that's okay because going back and looking at my videos from a year ago uh, I actually oh geez a year ago I was so different in my commentary it was so just crazy different and I don't know if I like that or not don't know what else we could do here, so we might just have to go with that. Uh, but I was so boring. I don't know how anybody ever liked me at that point, and I guess it sort of makes me understand why I never got any sort of traction back then. I was really bad. <laughs> uh, let's just let's just make this easy on myself, guys. I was a very very bad YouTuber up until just a couple months ago. Uh, my, my quality was bad, no matter if it was audio or video or commentary or whatever it may be. It was just terrible. I hope this skeleton doesn't get us. Um, this is crazy. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but I used to always wonder... Oh, what? Ah! <laughs> no, no, no. I used to always wonder why I wasn't growing. And me being relatively young um, can... can in comparison to most successful YouTubers, uh, it's easy to understand because just a year ago, my voice was a lot different. My commentary was a lot different. I couldn't make jokes. <laughs> I was really bad at making jokes. I don't, I don't even want to go in to start talking about that. I was honestly terrible. Could, let's move those up one. We're, ju we're just messing with a few things right now. Actually, why not make that cobblestone? Um, we don't want it there. We want it there. And we'll come in. Nah, I don't know what I'm going to do with this. I'll figure it out eventually, but I don't think that's going to work. I was going to put furnaces up there, but I don't feel like that's a good area. It's just sort of like a nice little hallway. I mean, we can turn it into something eventually. Or it could be the... We could go to the basement. Wow, that would be... That would be something... We'll have it, yeah, we'll have it come this way. Alright, so, 
I used, yeah, like I said again, and I actually do have to go out this way because I'm really stupid and I don't have an actual way down. Uh, we have to jump through here and over here, go around the entire house just to get out for right now because Duke's really bad at planning. Uh, but I, like I've said, I've been doing this YouTube thing for a very long time and seen lots of channels shoot past me in subscribers and views and likes and everything else. And now that I'm sort of getting the handle of YouTube, I'm, I'm sort of understanding, you know, why? Why did that ha I don't know if that's going to work either. Uh, why was I so bad? <laughs> oh, hey! Uh, but I really feel like a lot of it was just me being immature, and I didn't quite have the skills uh, that other people did. And could we, we make this happen. Hmm. Aha! Uh -huh. Oh ho! Look at that! We made that work. What the heck? Oh no! That's not gonna. There we go. Because that's that's an upside down stair right there, which is why that happened. And then we could come in through here, just make it look a little bit supported. We'll, we'll figure out what to do with this later. We don't want that to stay, uh, but it'll get better once we start you know sort of rooming this off but for now we have a way up and way down and I'm very pleased with that right here we might want to do something kind of simple we could put bookshelves there or something could work bring a little color into here because you know when Zyro <laughs> made that video about me I know it was an it was a joke and it was all in good fun and I, I liked it I laughed at it I even tweeted it out because I wanted people to know that I actually did really think it was a funny video and I'm I'm not mad or salty or whatever it may be about that uh, but he did say that I should add some color and I totally agree one thing I was gonna do is add a lot of leaves and stuff on here but that's not until later For right now I'm doing the interior of this thing and I'm just sort of thinking about what I can do in so I don't have any I, have, I guess I have some leather do I have any well, we could do this it's one way of going about it we could go get that sugar cane up there um, so it took me, I think, two and a half years to get to 100 subscribers. And it took me... Is there any more? It took me a year. A little less than a year. To go from 100 to 200. And neither one of those are very impressive. The thing impressive, though, is that we sort of got this momentum going. Okay? We're starting to pick up some subscribers. We're starting to move a lot l faster than I thought we were going to um, when we hit 100. When we hit 100, I was like, okay, yeah, we hit 100. Things are good. Things are fun. I'm very pleased with everything. But I knew how long it took to get to that point, and I was like, well, that doesn't really mean anything that we've hit 100 because I've got a long way to go if I, if I really want to start gaining anything. But lately... Things have been going good in the in the fact that it's almost as if things are working exponentially. And that's the thing about exponents is they start off relatively slow. But once they start picking up, they go. They go. Like if, if you're going, if you're multiplying the number 2, if, if you're doing exponents of 2, you know, you got, you got 2, 4, and then 16. I'm an idiot. I was thinking, okay, oh my gosh, I just, I'm going to include that in the video just to show how stupid I am, um, but no, 2 cubed is 8, so don't know what I was thinking there, but, <laughs> just, <sighs> okay guys, it's been so long since I've been in school, it's been a couple months, okay, so, so just let me be, I haven't, oh, I'm in advanced maths, oh, this is embarrassing, um, <laughs> but you know, things start. I'm I i can not even think right now. I am so dumb. Um, things start picking up. You know, it goes from two to four to eight. You know, it, it to sixteen, and things are just rapidly pick. They start just getting bigger and bigger and bigger. It's amazing. I really feel like I've just sort of screwed up this part of the recording, so I'm going to cut here.
All right, so we're back for that little brain fart. That was that was kind of stupid of me, uh, but I, I guess I've sort of gotten over it. We can sort of realize that, hey, everybody makes mistakes like that, and it's okay that I messed up there because everybody does stuff like that, guys. Um, you just started overthinking that. That's what. That's really what happened there. I started overthinking. I was like, you know, that it's not that much, and then it was, and I was like, oh, that's awkward. So, what do we need to do? Because I'm sort of looking at my chest here, and I'm realizing we need to grab some stuff and start getting to work on the interior, because the interior is really what will pull this entire thing together. Let's get that door. Uh, I think we want to separate this. I think we do. I'm going to put a door here, maybe. We could. It looks stupid from this side, uh, but it, it, there'll be a gap if we don't. So, if we put doors like here... <laughs> I love how that math thing sort of screwed up my entire, like, story because, no, I feel like an idiot and you guys are thinking I'm an idiot and I sort of lost track of what I was talking about. Because sometimes when you talk, uh, at least when I talk, I've noticed when I talk about something, it is very easy to start talking about it more and more. And I feel, oh, hey, look at this. It brought, it just brought this back to what I was talking about earlier. So... Like I was saying, things start picking up momentum. So so when I'm talking about something, it's very easy for me to keep going once I've started the topic. But but starting the topic is when I have my trouble. So it's sort of like so like with YouTube, uh, where when I started out it took me two and a half years to get to hundred, it's taken me less than a year to get to two hundred, which so what it means. If things go as planned, getting to three hundred subscribers should take a little less than half a year. Should. It should. <laughs> I'd like to think it will. That actually sounds very soon. Uh, I know it's not for some people, but, you know, being such a small channel and seeing how my history's gone, you wouldn't expect to hit it that quick. But I think we can. Uh, we're producing a lot more quality content. My videos are a lot more interesting. Uh, I actually have things to talk about. Um... You know, I have a nice community here on uh, an afterlife and stuff. Uh, people, people, people. Um, but yeah, but yeah. I feel like overall my channel has made great strides within this past year, and I'm happy to say that this is just sort of a, uh, you know, it's it's a nice wrap up, a nice, a nice sort of come together of our time spent um, between. 100 and 200 subscribers it took a long time but in the end i'm happy we made it and i'm happy that those countless hours of recording and scurrying up <laughs> is finally starting to mean something because even though i know a lot of people are probably like duke you're making this the more it should be 200 is really not anything what are you talking about um which i honestly wouldn't be surprised if people did because here's the thing guys if we really, we really want to take it back. Back when I hit 10. 10. 10 YouTube subscribers. I did a 10 subscriber YouTube special. <laughs> it was so funny to look back at that now. Because I was so proud of it. I was like, 10. We hit 10 subscribers. Woo! <laughs> it's so bad to look at now. Uh, and I can just laugh it off, which is a good thing. At least I'm not super embarrassed about it, and I can actually talk with you guys about it, because... Guys, I am facepalming so hard right now, and I apologize for everything. And the weird cut there. You're probably wondering, Duke, why would you cut? You were, you were talking good, and then all of a sudden it's like, but... And then it ends. You have no idea why I did that. And here's the thing. I didn't expect that to happen. I was recording, and all of a sudden... My recording software went out on me. And that doesn't happen normally. And it shouldn't have happened. But you know why it did? I ran out of space. So here's the thing. Oh, I think in the earlier in this episode, I think I did actually get this part in the recording. I have gotten better as a YouTuber. But here's what I haven't gotten better as a YouTuber. Making sure I have space <laughs> to record. Because I just talked for, what, probably 20 minutes. It was a great episode. Probably the best recording I've done in my life. 
So embarrassing. So embarrassing. And you guys are probably super disappointed in me. I am super disappointed in myself because I was really, truly pleased with it. Uh, but now you're never going to see that because I'll never be able to get that part back. Isn't that, isn't that life? Isn't that life, guys? Parts of life that you'll just never give back. Okay, Duke, cheer up. Uh, let's talk about something that you guys want to hear. So I was talking. I was talking about lots of things. I don't know if you guys got to see this, but I talked about, I watched a green video lately, and I'm sorry if I'm repeating myself here. I will leave this in the video if I am saying it again, because I just want to get this across. It's so important. So important. I was making this closet here, and I left this wall blank, and there's a reason behind that. This is the reason why I am not satisfied with my building and why I don't understand how some people are. Bedroom. Uh, hold up. I watched a green video lately, and we're, we're going to talk about this. I watched two, video, two green videos lately, um, which one sort of led into the other, which well, the one that led into the other really helped. Um, the first one I watched was his new video about the top... 10 best and worst Minecraft, Minecraft, <laughs> Minecraft blocks to use in your builds, and that really taught me a lot. I, I knew the majority of them. There are a few little ones in there that I was like, hey, you know, like Nether, Nether Brick, I've never used in a build, and because of that video, I sort of want to consider doing so now because it sounds interesting, and so I plan on doing that at some point. Um, but when that video was over, it brought me to his other video and his other video was simple it talked about 10 things to not do in minecraft building and this was a great video and I'm gonna tell you why at the beginning and throughout the majority of the video he was talking about stuff that everybody knows and um, a lot of that was simple it was simple for for builders like me or Logan or Hachi or Blonde Skunk or Zyra or White or Jay or <laughs> Dragonfrost or anyone on this server. I think I just named everyone. If I didn't, I'd feel awful. Um, did I not say Zyro? That would have been hilarious if I didn't say Zyro. Oh, poor buddy. Uh, me and Zyro are cool. Don't, don't, don't worry about that. Um, but <laughs> a lot of it was like, don't use the same block in all of your builds. Don't make them flat roofed, you know, add, a, add some nice shape, add some roofs to it. Uh, you know, there were lots of steps that all were really, really important, and I feel like everybody needs to know, and it was a great video. But that that was all simple stuff. I know that. I know that. I I've have enough experience, enough experience with this game to know adding some stuff like that really, really, really benefits your builds. Um, but the, the one thing that stuck out more than anything else, and I just want to just want to talk about that, because it struck me so hard. I was like, yes, this is what I needed to take away from the video. This is what I need to hear, because it's important. And a lot of self-proclaimed good builders, including myself, mess up here over detailing it's over detailing and that's where I can come in here and I can look at this house and I can open this door and I can look at this wall and say we don't need anything other than probably a painting here if this was still when I was doing Duke builds creatively every day or whatever I'd probably do something really impressive try to really spice up that wall and that's where I feel a lot of my building dies. A lot of my building goes from what could be a 9, an 8, a 10 out of 10, to being a 7. I over-detail things, guys. I do that a lot, and especially in my Duke Builds Creatively world, I just totally messed that part up. And I totally over-detailed everything. And I do apologize, because that's something I just had to learn. Okay? But now I know... 
things are better. And because of that green video, I can now do many things that I wasn't able to do. So, I hope other Minecraft builders out there take this into consideration as well. That when you're building, you know, adding color, adding depth, adding shape, those are all good things. But do not... <laughs> Do not over detail things. That is so difficult for me to understand and I feel like a lot of people to understand. Because when you see a flat wall, you just want to go all out. You you want to be like, "Hey, you know, this this could use this, you could this could use this." You know, this is all stuff that could really really help the build. So where a lot of us mess up. So, just thought I'd talk about that because it's going to help me with my building. Um Something I've tried to do lately is really try to put a lot of detail into things. I mean, sure, you know, Daddy Flats and this house don't really have too much. But my Duke builds creatively, guys. Everything is super detailed. And when I started building the barracks, I noticed it wasn't as detailed. And that's why I hated it. And I still do hate the build. Um, because it just looks so much different. It's not detailed. And that's where I struggled because I tried to put a lot of detail into things and it in the end it just didn't turn out very well and <sighs> we've been talking this is great this is great guys I mean I really thought when I screwed up on my episode that this was gonna be the end of the episode and things were just never gonna get back but once you get rolling guys I be yawning and stretching at the same time <laughs> <sighs> I've talked about so many different things, and I just want to keep talking, but I know this episode's getting long, but it's so difficult not to talk and talk and talk, because I love this episode. This episode's been great! This has been a great episode! I hope you guys are enjoying this as much as me. I am so passionate about recording right now. It is unreal. I just want to I just want to go build and have fun and, and enjoy everything about this house, because this house has been my favorite thing I've built so far this season, you know? Fort Duke and my spawn, my, my, my village house and daddy flats and my little underground place have not been as interesting as this house. This house has really given me life and inspiration for builds because there's a lot I can still do with this, but we're really getting somewhere. And even though the, the, the vines there are sort of only in one spot, we'll spread it out. And then I'm going to wrap up the episode here because we've been talking for quite some time and I don't like making my episodes too long because I want everybody be able to watch and enjoy the entire thing so we're gonna sort of wrap it up here but anyways there you go Zyro there you go bud I added some color and there's gonna be more color and next episode we're gonna work on the interior again and I know that's something I might struggle on with working on the same project over and over again but I'm so inspired and I feel like everything I've been saying has just really been really interesting for everybody else so next episode will be part actually I don't know if it will be. You saw how many deaths I have. That's for something um, that's already happened. But, uh, I hope you guys have enjoyed this episode. I have really enjoyed this episode. I'm sorry if I left off on any topic, if, if I didn't quite follow through with it. But I'm going to start recording another episode right when I'm done with this one. So, thank you guys for watching. This has been Duke. If you're new to the series, be sure to subscribe because there's always new Afterlife coming out every other day. If you liked today's episode and want more type of this commentary, more type of this episode, please hit that like button and the comment below why you feel that way. Because I really do. I really love this. So I hope you guys do as well. So thank you guys for watching. This has been Duke. Goodbye.